This is a view of the microsurvey transfer program. This will allow you to send the scenes from the data collector to the computer for processing. These are the libraries that are stored on the data collector and with the auto map check it will allow you to sync your library between the data collector and the computer. I'm going to identify the scene that I want to send to the computer and with a click of a button it's done. When you open the CAD program, you'll get a notification with the Sync Wizard import that these scenes are waiting to be downloaded. Here's how simple it is to download the scene. You can enter certain settings in here for the type of line work you want to come in, 2D or 3D, and any particular layer you want some line work to come in on. With a click of a button, the scene will appear on the screen. I'm going to zoom in and show you some of the features of the program here. You can see my line work, description, point number, and elevation for each of the shots I've taken, as well as the point data. I can pan and zoom around the scene. These descriptions come from my automap library. TM1 for me is tire mark 1. You can see tar mark 2, 3, 4, 5, gouge. Up above that you can see DYL, which is an abbreviation for double yellow line. With my layer manager I can toggle on and off the description, elevation, and the point number for each of the shots there. At this point I would save my work and then start editing the scene to complete the drawing. This is the scene of the truck that I showed you earlier on the data collector. The scene has already been downloaded. The text appears to be a bit large. With a click of a button I can rescale that text to a smaller size that will remove some of the clutter on the screen. I can zoom in. The text is still there attached to the point and to the line work. Makes it a bit easier to visualize the scene on the screen. I can rotate the scene to visualize it from the front, inspect my line work from the sides and from the back. MapScenes is a true 3D drawing program. You can see that I only have the left half of the truck here showing. I only need to draw one half. I can use a mirror command. Once the left half is drawn, mirror that side to the opposite side and my scene will be completed. 